What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. So, um, the manifolds are done, apparently. I'm gonna go check how they look, then we can quickly just see... Oh, how they look. <laughs> so the manifolds are done, I didn't think it started fitting yet, I don't know. So we're gonna go check how the manifolds look, and everything maybe, just maybe, he started with the fitting and that, because he has to build a down pipe and everything as well, so probably not. But we're gonna go check how it looks, I'll check you there. I'm not gonna have a very long drive to the place and everything. I'm just gonna make it as short as possible because you guys wanna see the turbo and the bolt, not all of the other cock in the video. What's up guys, it's Editing Chris here and I went through all of the footage and I just think it's gonna work out better if we go through what he did on the actual microphone then trying to listen to me with the mask on and everything. It sounded shit. So what we're gonna do is talk about all of the things he did on this. Okay, so here we got one of the two manifolds. Both of them look kind of the same, it's just the bend at the end that's different. So they are separate, but they get together in a V-band. And here's my little Terpski. This is where it's gonna fit on the car. Looks nice, eh? Watch this magic trick. Filter on! So you can get an idea of exactly how big it's gonna be. It is a bit over the engine, but we've got heat wrap, a turbo blanket and everything. We made sure the clearance is okay, so it will fit. Should be A4 away. Here is the last lip. So in this lip you can see exactly how the table will fit with the shroud on and where the water ball is going to be, the steering pump, all of that jazz, it's figured out. So that's the rough idea of how it's going to look. Okay guys, so the manifold's done, technically. Um, it's not completely on the car yet because yeah, it's to still find a way to put the wastegate on properly. Not a way, to find proper, the best way to put on the wastegate so we've still got enough space and everything. Shut up, Tani! Fuck! Sorry, I'm getting a bit of aggression here towards my GPS anti because she's irritating me. Um, but yeah, so I'll, I'll put a few clips here of how she looks and everything. Still gonna be a while till I get the car because he has to build the down pipe. I want him to do a stainless straight pipe from the down pipe to the back so the car is nice and loud. I want to irritate everybody on the road. Yeah, um, and then I want him to pull the intercooler pipes and these trucks are cutting me off because there are a bunch of assholes yeah <laughs> so I still want them to build me the intercooler pipes as well and do all of the because he's doing the entire fitment as well so he's gonna fit everything and get it done for me swap the water bottles over but at the moment at least the turbo the manifold's done and the turbo has been test fitted so the turbo fits um, He's gonna struggle a bit with the down pipe. Pretty sure of it. But yeah, I just today I got some heat shield wrap for the car so we don't melt things. Because that wouldn't be ideal, would it? Um, but he said the car will be done by the end of the month. Why is this guy driving so slow? Stupid idiot. So the car is gonna be done in around two weeks. He said he needs around another 10 days. So, I don't know about you guys, but I am getting very excited. 10 days isn't that far away, and then the car is going to be done and fast. Well, it's not going to be completely done because I still need to do the fuel pump. But then the turbo's on, then we're going to do some pulls and listen to that single turbo sound. Yeah. So, check in the next one. Cheers, I.